vehicle! Why would you do that to me? Seedot, the grass-type Pokemon, evolves into Shiftry. I think it's grass and dark, and it's very fast, and it's very good, so that could be a good one. Let's see what my first encounter could be in this grass. Skarmory, that's pretty cool. Sora is better than Skarmory. Oh, that's a legendary! Oh, it's Lugia! It's Lugia! Oh, I really hope I get this as my first encounter. Please, 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 let me catch this. <laughs> What's up, everyone, and welcome to episode one ish of the Pokemon Heart Gold Randomized Nuzlocke. I say one-ish because at the end of the live stream uh, yesterday, day before, we um, actually sort of did episode one. But it was only like 15 minutes, and all we did was get our starter Pokemon, which ended up being, as you can see, following me around here, C Dot, as well as uh, coming to the first route and see what possible first encounters we might have. And if you've watched the intro, you know full well that this could get very interesting very quickly. So, I mean, I just want to crack on, really. So, the first thing we need to do is go to Mr. Pokemon and also see what other encounters are available in this grass and on the grass on the way to Mr. Pokemon. So while we're going up there, um, I think it's fair just to say a big thank you to everyone who came into the stream uh, on... God, man, why am I getting my days so mixed up? Wednesday? There's Lugia again. Yeah, everyone who came into the stream, thank you so much. Um, whether you were chatting or not, whether you stayed for five minutes or 30 seconds, whatever, it doesn't matter. I really appreciate you being here. It was... I mean, I definitely... I had a great time until I was having a shit time. So, we've seen everything in this route, which means our next move... Oh, this old man's gonna talk shit at us. That's what our next move is. You're a rookie trainer, aren't you? I can tell. That's okay, everyone is a rookie at some point. If you'd like, I can teach you a few things. Okay, then follow me. Okay, then. Why are we just still go? Oh, I'm sorry, I forgot you weren't wearing the running shoes, so you can't move at all. I'll try and show you as slowly... Oh, no. I'll try and go as slow as possible, so try keeping up. Yes, sir. This is a Pokemon Center. Honestly, does he not know that I'm a Pokemon freaking master? Or oh, what are them weird, weird black squares next to his head? Ugh. I think he's melting. There's more. Whew. So Route 30 is a new route. That's good to know, I suppose. Here's some water. This is the sea, as you can see! <laughs> oh, old running man's got puns! Yes! Oh dear. Here, it's my house! Oh! They're gonna give, it, give me his ruddy shoes, they're still warm! That's gross! I mean, he's a man, an old bloke, I don't know what kind of foot disease he's got. Oh, oh yeah! <laughs> he's full of the jokes, this old man, isn't he? Yes! He's, that's twice he's got me. CC, warm running shoes, you're a clever bloke. I didn't read any of that, if it wasn't important. And now I think we can run. Yes! Uh, and I may as well heal up while I'm close by. There we go. Hello and welcome to Pokemon Shins, which likes fish Pokemon? Yes. Okay, I'll take a Pokemon for a few seconds. Thank you for waiting, you showed your Pokemon to full health. Please come back again any time. We'll do this, Joy, thank you. Thank you, bye. Right, so... Oh, now he wants to talk to me. It's him again. Why is the old man following me around in this game? I 
forgot about one thing. This is another token from me. Take it. Map card. Oh, good lad. I'll take that. Thank you. I'll take it all back. You're not so bad. That's interesting because it means we can double check that whenever we need to. Just to have a look at where our next encounter is going to be. So at the minute, we're... So, here's a starting town. We've got Route 29 there when we get Pokeballs. Route 46, we can get one there as well. What's this? Togo City, there's some fish in here, but we haven't got a fishing rod yet. Route 30, that's one. Dark Cave's one. Route 31 is one. So, and Sprout Tower in uh, Violet City is one as well. So, I mean, really, we could get six, one, two, three, four, five, six encounters before the first gym. So, you know, that could be decent. Well, let's get a run through and we'll see our Professor Pokemon. Sharp Beak, which increases the power of flying moves, I believe. And, oh. Hey, kiddo, how in the world can you be so oblivious to my eye-catching house? Hold it right there. Well, he really wants to give me free stuff. When you follow that path north, you'll see Miss Pokemon's house. But before you go, let me finish what I have to say. Do you have any apricorns? Apricorn trees bear fruit once a day. I have one of these trees too. Apricorns are really something. You can make Pokeballs and other things. Yeah, quite useful. I have a good feeling this is meant to be. Here's something for you. He basically just chased me outside to give me something for free. Good lad. Thanks. Oh, we'll have this then. Green apricorn. So, yeah, remember all items on the floor are randomised. That shot beak normally is probably like a potion or something. Absolutely useless. So, Soul Rock, possible encounter we could get in this route. I'm going to battle it, actually. See if I can... Oh, no, if he's just going to harden, why bother? Scrap that. Oh, actually, confusions, that's good. Perfect. Question is... How many more of those can I survive? Nah. Oh! Can't escape, that's not good. Oh, it doesn't matter. I just remember, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter if I faint, because... Those lot rules don't start until you've got Pokeballs. I have not picked up a Pokeball. Rules haven't begun yet. But I still don't really want to faint. I'd rather get experience from the battle if I can. Yeah, let's do it. Oh, it knows! Ah, when I go for Bide, it goes for Harden rather than actually hitting me. It knows. And again. Well... And see, it knows. I quite, I kind of like that. At the same time, that like, I hate it because it's screwing me over. But when we've just been playing Brown, the AI was like absolutely dumb as fuck. So it's kind of quite refreshing to have a AI that's gonna give me a decent battle now and then. Oh, like this one. And if I don't get an attacking move on this C dot soon, I'm gonna have absolutely no chance. Because I can't just keep. Once I've got Pokeballs, I can't just rely on Bide. That is a recipe for disaster. Use a sword and defense rises, blah blah blah. We'll Bide again. Come on, it's it us, it us, it us. That's it. That's the ticket. Come on, Mogswold. Nice. And there goes Solrock. And some... Hopefully that's going to be a couple of levels, I would have thought. Yeah. At least one. Learn something. Uh. Mm. Let's get out of that grass. Everstone. Uh. I suppose I can sell it, at least get some money for it, but it's not really useful to me. What do we got next? Sandshrew! I want, I, you know, I, want, I wouldn't mind finding a Sandshrew in this route, that'd be fine. It 
no scratch, so at least it's got an attacking move. Last time goes for defense curl. But it knows, it knows. Like any battle I have to have is going to be so based on luck with this thing. For example, that scratch does three damage. So if it hits me more than once now before I can heal up, I'm going to die. Oh man, this is absolutely dreadful. How tedious. I don't really... I mean, I want to train the thing up, so I want to keep using these potions and not just run away. But at the same time... Damn. Damn. That's alright. One more bide and I think he's going to go down. If it actually hits us, that is, of course. So your energy, come on, come on, come on. Scratch. There we go. Gotcha. Now, please, no more encounters until I've got past Mr. Pokemon's house. Da -da -da -da. Perfect. Growth, not really useful. I've not got any attacking moves. Also, TMs that can be found on the ground can also be ra are also randomised. And the ability to learn them from each Pokemon is randomised as well. There's a good chance I will find something, something, that I can teach it. Pink Apricorn, that's cool. And we are at Mr. Pokemon. Or Press Pokemon. I don't know. You must be seen. It was I who sent an email to Press Rome earlier. just walked into his bookcase. How pissed is this guy? This is what I want Professor Arm to examine. Mystery egg. Mystery egg. A friend of mine from Ectroteak gave it to me. I bet you can't find this kind of egg in Johto. I thought Professor Arm might be able to tell me what it is. He's the best when it comes to research Pokemon Evolution. That's a quote from the famous Professor Oak, who happens to be stood right there. Thanks for healing me up. Old buddy Oak jump. And here's old Sammy Oak right now. What's up, Sammy? And with that, I'm Professor Oak, a Pokemon researcher. So you're Saint. I was just visiting my famous Pokemon. I heard you were running around for Professor Oak's whole idea. Oh, uh, get off my Pokemon. Back off. Nah, he's alright. He's alright, uh, Professor Oak. You seem to be dependable. How would you like to help me out? Of course. Any time I'll do anything for you, Professor. And I've got a Pokedex. Beautiful. Go meet many kinds of Pokemon and copy that Pokedex. <sighs> Ooh, it's early, early. But I've stayed too long, I have to go to go and roll for my radio show. See ya. See ya. Oh, another old man giving me his phone number. Where's old Totty giving me the number? Do you know what I mean? I'm a, I'm a shit hot Pokemon trainer. I should be getting all the girls. Not old men. Oh, no, here's Professor Owl speaking of. Hello, Saint. It's a disaster. It's just terrible. What should I do? Oh, no, please come back here now. Well, shit's gone down, and obviously I'm the only one that can save the day. A ten-year-old with no experience as a trainer. Aww. Ah, it's not true. It's cool. No more battles, though. No more battles until I beat the uh, rival. Not that I know what's coming up, of course, because, well, I don't know. It's not like I've played this game 50 million times before. Kabutops. Yeah, that's not too bad, I suppose. I'd take that if I had that as my encounter. <clears throat> Brilliant. Cherry Grove City. Uh, I don't need to heal because I've already fully healed. So let's go take on. Uh, let's go take on our rival. You got a Pokemon at the lab? What a waste! That's a Pokemon that's too good for a wimp. Well, something like that. Don't you get what I'm saying? I too have a good Pokemon. I show what I mean. It's our first rival battle. And there she is. She, because I'm going to name her after a girl. So it's a she this time. And it's got. It picked the Ammonite. Sorry, she picked the Ammonite. Okay, so. I mean, really, I should buy. 
Constrict. Oh, this is going to take a while, because that's going to do nothing. Constrict again. Oh, this this is this is going to be tedious. I'm sorry, I have to watch this two minutes. Might even time lapse this. This is painful. Ugh, oh, so slow. Oh dear me. I mean, I'm just I'm, I'm pretty much just got to sit in mash A right now. That's all I can really ask for. Oh dear me. Recording this on the fifth, so uh, I think it's fair that I can now say I hope everybody had a nice fourth of July. Obviously, we're going to celebrate it over here. Why would we? You dirty treasonous bastards! Nah, I'm, I'm kidding. We love you, really, America. But yeah, I hope we've all had a good Independence Day. Didn't get to see any fireworks here, which is the thing I get jealous about. So any day when you can have fireworks is a good day. We're getting closer. We're getting closer. Oh, this is the most tedious thing. Draw. Oh, this is the thing. It's not even hitting me. This is a battle I can't get away from either, so... Here we go. What I'm worried about is that it runs out of constraints, and then... can't hit it, and then we just end up having a thrash off, basically, which sounds a bit good. Come on, come on, come on! Draw. I only need to hit me one more time, so that my bike can damage it. There we go. I think, I think that's, I think we've done him. Woo! Good XP from when I'm night as well. 105, decent. That's a level at least. Possibly. Close to two. Yeah, that'll do. Still not learned anything though. Are you happy you won? Yes, I'm glad I beat you. And I'll beat you again. Do you want to know who I am? I'm going to be the world's greatest Pokemon trainer. And push me out of the way, Biatch. Oh no! Give that back! That's my trainer card! I know you saw my name! I know who you are now! I know who you are! I know who you are! Damn it! She's not happy about that. Oh, there's a bloody tree there. Could definitely just jump over that tree, it's absolutely tiny. So I suppose seeing as Professor Elm sounded so desperate, we best hurry up. Yo, Pro Elm, what's up? Pro Elm! Oh, it's Copper. Who are you? We're investigating the case of the missing Pokemon here. Rule number one, whoever did it will come back to the site. I don't think that's the rule. No, no, I'm pretty sure that's not how it goes. Oh my, so you must be the one who did it! You know what, there's no wonder this kid's getting away with stealing rare Pokemon in this world if the police are this incompetent. Oh, Lyra's here to save the day. Hold on a second, he has nothing to do with it. I saw it, there was a red-haired girl looking into the building. What? What? You battled a girl like that? <laughs> she must be the one who did it. Did you happen to get her name? I did, actually. It was on her trainer card. And her name was... Man, I can't fit any of I can't fit any of your nicknames in that space, Be uh, Becca. So I'm sorry. You're gonna just have to be Becca. So Becca was her name. Yes. Thanks for helping my investigation. My next assignment is to search for this red-haired individual. Individual. And there's Lyra. Lyra, stop coming on to me. Oh. Give her the egg. Give him the egg. Dun 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 dun. dun. And we'll come back for that egg in a bit. Oh no, we don't think we do have to come back here. I think the guys are the Pokemon who gives it to us. He sends him with us. Yeah. 
Right, and again, this is a randomized Nuzlocke, so that egg could have absolutely anything inside of it. It could be a legendary, it could be a, a Jigglypuff, you know. And the amount of steps you need to take to hatch it will reflect what's inside of it because, you know, better Pokemon generally need more steps to hatch the eggs. So it could be very interesting. Right, now, please, nobody else interrupt us. Just let me get... Oh my god, why is she following me? Why am I being stalked by Lyra? There you are! You know exactly where I was going to go, you little stalker. You little stalker, you! You can catch wild Pokemon with Pokeboard. Follow me. She must think I'm so dim. Ooh. Stamp on it! Stamp on it again! Stamp on it again! I mean, this is just... That wasn't catching a Pokemon! Try again, come this... Okay, you're going to show me properly now. Oh, well, let's just... Put my control down and enjoy the show then, eh? Quite sire! Wow. She's got a need around. What happened to Meryl? Why she just used Leah? Wow, this is going to be a good battle. Leah versus Mudsport. No, it's not. His HP's not down at all. Why are you lying to me, Lyra? Lyra, Lyra, pants on fire! Am I right? I'm right. I'm right. Balls! Brilliant, thank you very much. And now I'm guessing you give me some Pokeballs. Yeah, you give me my... If just because you're giving me your balls, I mean I'm going to give you mine, Laura. Lyra. <laughs> oh, shit, I've got a name wrong. She definitely doesn't want them anymore. On the first encounter, it is the Lugia. Yes! Right, okay. Please, please catch this thing. Come on. Come on. Right. Oh, I'm at full health. Shit. I feel like even though I'm much higher level than this thing, it's probably going to body me. Which, because I've got poke balls, the Nuzlocke's just started. So if I die now, that's every, that's just game over before it starts. But it's short, it's Nuzlocke ball. Right, when the ball does nothing, so I can bide that shit. Weather ball again. I wonder what if it knows anything else. Whirlwind. No! No, 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 no! Oh my god! Nothing's ever going to change. I'm always going to have shit looking in those locks. It's never going to change. I oh, wonder what else it knows, which I've not asked. <coughs> <sighs> right, well, that's it then. I can't get an encounter in the first route. <sighs> I, don't, I mean, I don't, I've lost all the interest. I would have rather had the Skarmory and it not fly away than... Oh, I, I can't even get words out right now. Right, well, let's try the next route. Go away, Lugia. I already can't have you. It's too late. I'm not, I can't even I can't even look you in the eyes right now, Lugia. I, I don't even want to see you. I'm not looking against you off the screen. Go away. I'm having to look so I can get you off my screen, but... <laughs> Go away. Oh, dear me. Right, what's up here? Ah, so yeah, this route, it's got ledges, so you can't get any further, but there is a encounter to get before it happens, before you run into it. So, let's see what we get. Hippopotus! I like Hippopotus! I had a Hippopotus in... 
a Pokemon Black randomizer I was just playing not long ago. I was playing along with Vinny and Dobbs. Right, so can we catch it? Let's use Bide to start off with. Sand attack, not helpful. Sand attack again. Oh dear, so that's a nothing Bide. Maybe it only knows sand attack. Let's uh, just go for Bide one more time. There we go. Still not doing anything. Might as well just throwing a ball in first place. Not bothered. Yeah. We'll just throw a ball. Accuracy must be on line zero by now. <clears throat> Come on. Stay in the ball. 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 We got a hippopotamus. We got a hippopotamus. We got a hippopotamus. Personal effect. Data was added to the Pokedex. It shrouds itself in sand to ward off germs. It travels easily through the sands of the desert. Perfect. There's no deserts in this region. Give a nickname to the hippopotamus. Yes. And uh, we're going to name this hippo after my. <laughs> <laughs> After my beautiful wife. <laughs> She's going to be so thrilled when I show her. <laughs> oh dear me. Please, I don't want all the comments that I'm sh like fat shaming or anything. She's not even, not even a little bit. Oh, Lugia's back to haunt me. I used to get Lugia and Latias mixed up. It's so different, I don't know why. I have to think about it then to make sure I said the right one. I was like, wait, did I say Lugia? Did I say Latias? Alright, let's get through this route, get healed up. And, uh... Well, interestingly, this might end up doing the opposite of what you normally do. I might end up having my lower end Pokemon out front. And then swapping. No, sorry, having my higher out front and then swapping in the lower one because I can't really do any damage with C dot until it gets a new move. Right, can I buy balls in here yet? Because I've only got five, so. I can. I'm gonna have another. Uh, another five. And more top up on potions as well. And we'll also take... No, 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 no. Uh, a few antidotes. I'm not bothered with the paralysis, though, because I generally just seem to grind... I tend to grind through paralysis. Rather than waste money healing it up. Okay, this is our first encounter in this route now. Something good. Kaboot tops. Rock water type, I think? No, rock. Just rock. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, because it's on a star that's the rock water. Okay. Well, I feel like you're going to go for offensive attacks, so I'm going to go for Bide. Let's absorb. Not going to do too much, because I'm a grass type. So. Glad I stayed in with Mogswall, though, because... Uh, Hannah would have got thrashed by that absorb, probably. Now, do I stick in for another bide? Yes, I'm gonna. And as long as it doesn't go for like... Yeah, it's gone for absorb. So even if it goes for tackle now, I still shouldn't kill it off, I don't think. Well, that's cool because now I can throw. I've got plenty of time. I can throw a ball. He's not dead. I can hit it again if I need to. So let's go for the ball. I have nine of them. I feel like the catch rate for this is going to be quite difficult because it's an evolved fossil. Yes. 
Cuddle Castle's got. Dun 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 dun. Gotcha. Sucks in its limbs to become more compact than it wiggles its shell to swim fast. Oh, it is rock and water. Look at that. Who knew? I did. Give it a name to Kabutops. Yes. Uh, what should I call this dude? Call him. Wait, is it a. Yeah, it's a guy. Um, I'm just going to call it Slash. Because he can rip some sick riffs. So slash. Next. Oh. Oh. Another one. So I think on this route. Sorry, on the way to the next town. Get every encounter possible. Work out what is going to be a permanent member of the team and then I'll sort it out at the Pokemon Center at the next town. So I've already got the encounter for this route, so I need to... Sand through. I like Sand Slash, but Rock and Water is good coverage now. I've got Rock and Water, I've got a grass that I think is going to get that man in there, that I going to become a grass dock, and I've got uh, a ground as well. So I'm pretty... I'm already pretty well covered. Trying to shoot another ground, so it probably would have uh, not been so good actually. Next. Come on, come on, come on. Let's get through this grass. There we go. Right, so now we have battles to do. So let's do. Oh, I'm pressing the wrong button to get the menu again. Uh, so I don't have anything with flying time moves, so that's not useful. Let's just use that on. Uh, slash. I don't know what I... Well, let's... Let's start with Slash out for and see what happens with that. And see what this guy's got for us. <clears throat> I'm just lost, so I'm trying to find more Pokemon. Wait, you look weak. Come on, let's battle. I don't look weak. I don't look weak. I'm a fucking... BEEFCAKE! I look weak. You've got a Togepi. I look weak. You've got a Togepi. Nah, to be fair, that thing's probably got a metronome. Which would be useful. Oh wow, it's not going to do anything. It's got Growl, that lowers the attack. So my attack's down one. Eh, I might just have to go for Slash, I think. Oh my gosh, this thing's bulky. The thing is, I don't know if it has any physical attacks against me, so... I don't even know if I can bide it. So far it's gone for Charm and Growl, that's it. Wow, this is a really slow start. Let's... Oh no, I didn't mean to run. I want to switch. No, oh, I said I didn't mean to run! Uh, so, let's get a Hannah out there. Growl lowers the attack again. What we got? Tackle. And misses. For goodness sake. Charm lowers. So it's lowering my attack. But it's not going to do anything else to me, so. Oh my god. Literally all I can do is grind this out. I'm going to time lapse this. Oh, critical. Perfect. There we are. And Hannah gets level 3 as well. Bang on. Youngster new AL. I'm out of Pokemon that can fight. That's how it works, son. Can I get your number? Yay, finally! Not an old man trying to get my number. Just a young boy. Just don't tell anybody because I don't want people to get the wrong idea. This guy. You're a Pokemon trainer, right? Then you have to battle. I'm right. Challenged by Youngster Daniel. Mm -hmm. We're going with 
this slash. And we we'll just scratch the fuck out of this thing, I would have thought. Ooh. I wonder if Slash can actually learn Slash, because I quite like that move. High critical hit. Ratio. Beautiful. Ooh. Wheezing. Ooh, that's... That thing could have self-destruct or explode. And... Oh, God. It's... I'm getting flashbacks. No! Oh, critical! Why would you do that to me? Oh, no. Oh, no. This could be bad. I have very, very, very bad memories of the last time I saw a Weezy. So this could be very bad. Oh no. Ugh, please excuse me for one second. Ugh. I was just going for smokescreen and stuff, so... be okay, I guess. Smog doesn't hit. Poison gas doesn't hit. Oh man, come on, these battles are just the worst battles that I've ever been in. Oh man. So let's try Hammer. Finally it hits us with Poison. Which at least that means something's happening. Let's try the Tackle. Now he's going to start doing offensive moves. Good crit. I'm getting some good luck with the crits here. I feel like I can have one more go with this guy and then I'm going to have to uh, swap it up. At least everyone's getting some experience here. Wait, slash or multiple? Slash, 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 slash. Or the slash. Smoke screen is the most annoying move ever. I'll go for the scratch. It hits. Oh man. Oh, and it gets the poison again. Absorb misses. Of course it does. Come on. Remember when I used to? I remember when I used to enjoy playing Pokemon games, and then I started doing Nuzlocks, and it all became too stressful. Yeah. Yeah. Smog again. That's gonna lower the accuracy again. Oh, that was smoke speed. I'm Pokemon Master, honest. Come on, critical. Like it. Come on, critical. Critical hit. Oh, I'm going to have to swap out. Oh, man. Come on, Mog. Finish this wheezing off. I'm not having my luck ended twice by a fucking wheezing. Bide this. Now come for that tackle again. Smog will do. It's super effective because it's poison and I'm grass. Misses the poison gas, but I've got enough energy to smash him to bits. Thank goodness for that. Yes! Slash gets up to level 4. Hannah gets up to level 4. Mog's roll probably won't get up a level. But it's good progression. That's strange, I won before. Oh. That was that was dreadful. Alright, let's run back to Pokemon Center. Okay, here we are. I've been back to Pokemon Center and healed. Let's get back up here. She's not a trainer and she's gonna tell me so. I'm not a trainer. I remember that girl. This, however, is a trainer. And I'm up for it. Instead of bug Pokemon, I found a trainer. I ain't seen any book Pokemon around here, mate. Don't bother. Comes out with Chimchow. So. 
I don't remember Tim Charles typing. I'm gonna go for absorb and guess. Mm, not really useful. We'll just go for a scratch instead though. It goes for rap. Don't care about that. Just gonna do little bits of damage, but hopefully scratch should uh, rip this to bits. Mm. I was expecting because Boo Top Kabutops is like the evolved one that his stats would be pretty beastly already and I wouldn't I'd be absolutely hammering things, but I guess not. Jim Chow uses rap again. Might be the only thing it's got, I think. Which is absolutely fine to be honest, I don't mind that. Chuck in another scratch, and that's gonna be the end of him. I love the soundtrack to this game. I think this is why this is probably my favourite Pokemon game, part of Gold and Soul The soundtrack's amazing. Like the the way they remade both regions was absolutely brilliant. Speaking of remaking regions, I cannot wait for Pokemon Let's Go. And anybody that says differently is an absolute tip. It's gonna be so good. Absorb! So I'm gonna play until yeah, I'm gonna play until the next time. Get to the Pokemon Center and then we'll call it this. This I mean I could have got that done in like 15 minutes, but because of how grindy and shite this episode's had to be, uh, it's gonna be slow. And I can't wait till my Pokemon have got some strong moves so I can just start obliterating things. Ice. Level six. Beautiful. Just keep moving. It's me mum! All right, mum! Hello, Saint. I heard from Pressville, but you went on a long trip. I wish you would have told me. <laughs> Sorry, mum. What about your money? Should I save it? No. Because I know what you're going to do, you fucking dick. You'll go and buy... Oh, Saint, I went to the shop and I saw something you might want, so I've put it in your PC for you. I've bought it out of your money. It's a polka doll. Great. Thanks. All right, new route, Route 31. So, new encounter. New encounter. What are we going to get? Ugh, it's a quillfish. That's not exciting at all. Oh dear. Well, it's got poison ability of some sort, so I suppose that's pretty good. Poison Sting, but still, Poison Sting's still a really crap move, though. And because Poison doesn't kill outside of battle in this game, I'm going to let it get my Slasher's health down to one. Soothe Bell, that's pretty cool. And then I'm going to throw a... Potion at him. Save myself having to use an antidote. Right, so. There's Dark Cave. Let's get an encounter in here as well. Good music. Oh, look. That's a bit glitchy. I can see where I'm going already. Oh, I can't go that way anyway, so it's not useful. Well, let's keep walking in until we get an encounter then. What do we got? What do we got? It's... It's Reggie Rock! It's a Reggie Rock at level 2. I don't know if I'm going to be able to catch it. Oh, man. Just adding a legendary to the team right now would be so good. What can I hit it with that's not going to kill it, though? Scratch. Scratch is going to be okay. It's, it resists it anyway. I was going to go for absorb. Oh, no. He's gone for explosion. No, 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 no. Oh, that's okay. That's okay. Oh, God damn it. Oh, man. Oh, wow. That was just the most stressful. Oh, okay, I'm good. God damn it, though. I could have had a Regirock. Why do these legendaries keep exploding and whirlwinding and just 
blowing me away like a mighty wind. Uh, make sure there's nothing worth getting in here. I know you can't really get anywhere in here until you've got surf and stuff, so. Oh, there's an item though. Nugget. Perfect. Again, that's a randomised item, so we can be quite glad that that's shown up there. Some pretty good luck. Can I get down to that ball down there? No, got to surf. Oh, I can't believe you, Reggie Rock! I can't believe you were here and I could have had you. You know what, you're going to explode anyway, so I'm going to hit you. And I'm going to let you explode. And then, um, yeah, get some experience points. I can't believe that. Two legendaries have let me down. There well. So we're on Route 31, which means that there's one more encounter to go before... No, there's no more to go before the town. There's one more before we go to the gym. And that is in Bellsprout Tower. And we will go in there before we end the episode and finish it off. However, I'm going to battle this guy because he's got a lot of Pokemon. I think he's got a full team at level 2, if I remember right. Which could be a lot of experience, depending on what they are. Oh my god, it's a Palkia. This guy's got a legendary. This one stayed in the ball, didn't explode or whirlwind him. Scary face misses. I'm gonna go for scratch. Um, this should be a good bulk of experience for beating this thing. Scary face speed, I don't care about that, that's fine. Oh, Dragon Breath though! Oh! Oh, it's fine. Oh my god. I gotta be careful with these Dragon type Pokemon because if one of them's got Dragon Rage, that's like GG game over. Just 40 HP every time. I haven't got a Pokemon with over 40 HP, so it would just wipe out my whole team. GG good game. Thanks for playing. See you later. Flaffy. Let's stick in Mog's Wall for that. Should be neutral against me. Uh, which means I should be able to use the Bide. Hopefully it goes for some attacking moves. So without speed, we get the Bide. It's only level 3 as well. Thundershock's good. Only does 1 HP though. Shame. It means I can't really stay in with Mark's Ward, otherwise it's going to take... ...days and days and days to kill this thing. I ain't got time for that. So we will swap in for. Oh, I've oh, got this. This guy here is a ground type. So. A thunder shock's not going to affect, and I can just pull the shit out of it. Uh, it knows though, so it goes for growl, and we will go straight for tackle. Oh my god, that's doing just as just as little as anything else. <sighs> I really need a good Pokemon on this team right now. Oh, gosh. It's the battle, battle of the tackle right now. Oh, the frustration. Growls again. Oh man, you're slowing this down so much. I hate you. I hate you, Flaffy. Why is Tackle only doing like one or two HP to Flaffy anyway? Come on, man. It's a Flaffy. Well done, Hannah. Good effort. Well done, Mogswold. Come on, learn something. Ugh. Octillery. Yes, we will have Slasher. Rock water type, which means it's going to be neutral to water attacks. Oh, I've got absorb, which is grass type. Oh my god, it knows aura beam. Oh, it's nothing. It's fine. Not very effective. Not bothered. Why am I even making a big fuss about it? Absorb. That's going to be super effective. Yes. Perfect. Also, no side beam. 
Dude, I want an artillery. These are shit up. Wow. Yes! An artillery is down! 69 XP. Learn something! Tauros. Eh, uh, that's sticking for a bit, why not? What is a level, what is a level 12, level 2 Tauros now, do you think? Stomp, maybe? Definitely tackle. Oh, wow, that crit matters. One more of them and we're done. Ah, paralysis. Paralysis, my old rival. Not really. So we'll get Hannah in there. Get a bit of the action. Just the tackle, but don't really do much. And I will tackle you back, and hopefully that will be enough. Oh, one more. One more, one more, one more. Thanks for playing, Tauros. Perfect. Number five, we're gonna move. Nope. Book catcher Jasmine, thank you very much. You're awesome, I like you. Okay. Absolutely. Let's, let's show numbers, my dude. Register the phone number, you're there for most of the fun you might like. Uh, bye bye. And down here we have Spooky Plate! Absolutely no use to me right now, and isn't that what you have to like give Arceus to make it a ghost type? Or Arceus or whatever. Held by Pokemon, stone tablet that boosts, oh, it also boosts the power of ghost type moves, so that's, that's decent I suppose. If I were to get something with ghost type moves. The Coalfish? Did I catch Coalfish before? I didn't, did I? I just, I just killed it, I didn't want it. Called it a no encounter basically. What's, what's this guy want? Final good Pokemon in Dark Cave. Yeah, I did as well, but I couldn't catch it. Well, here we are. Violet Town. Violet City, whatever it's called. Lyra, you little stalker man, at least drop me a DM so I know you're coming. I knew it was you, Saint. How did you get past me? Here's something neat for surprising me. Versus recorder. Thank you. Let's go, Maril. And we continue. Quick heal up at the Pokemon Center. And then straight up to Sprout Tower, where we're going to start making our way through, get our first encounter, and then when we get an encounter, we'll leave it there. And we will uh, come back for the next episode next time, where we'll take on Sprout Tower, take on the gym, and all those, all those good, nice, tasty things we need doing. I will come back in the future, thank you. I love the goddamn the music in this game. Right, here is Sprout Tower. So there's nothing. Oh, nothing to be seen on the first floor. However, there are encounters and battles on the way up. So, first thing is a battle. However hard we battle, the tower will stand strong. Good, it's been built well. And we have Sage Joe, the Zubat. Pretty standard for Sage Joe, that Zubat. Zubat has got drought. Wow. That's unexpected. You know, that's a fair point. I haven't been looking at what the abilities of all my Pokemon are. I know that C Dot says I'm Fist, which is not really useful. I do have a lot of other ones are. This could be something I can really take advantage of. Bit four. Next. Lucario. Ho Go on, Hannah. Get out of here. Oof, beast. And let's go for the tackles. Protect. Oh. It's gonna be like that, this is gonna be long. Sunlight's still out from uh, the drought. There's some metal claw. Hey, you know what? It's pretty 
Good beastie. Oh, and that's a critical as well, man. Yeah. Ain't got no room for that, I'm afraid. It's gonna have to be Slasher again. Oh, it's frustrating because Hannah's not high enough level or got a good enough move to do anything. C dot hasn't multiple sorry hasn't got a good enough move to do anything. Which leaves me with Slash and that's it really. Lucario goes for Detect. But that's okay, because we can absorb again. Detect fails twice in a row. And here comes Absorb. Yep. That does nothing! Oh, I'm going to best get comfortable, because this is going to take a while. Oh, it's alright, we're getting there. We're getting there. Lucario should be a absolute shit ton of XP as well. Because he's a monster. Spiky hands and stuff. But keeps going for the detect, and I don't know why. He's not achieving anything. He's stalling me out. There's the slash. Hey! Perfect. Thank you for coming. 64 HP, XP. No one levels up. And we've got one more battle to go. Come on. Slowpoke. Absorb the absolute shit out of this guy. And absorb. I'll do. Goes for curse. What does that do? Lower his defense, higher his attack. Lower his speed, higher his attack. And defense. Cool. Well, he's not going to get to do another move anyway, because I'm already faster. He's just lowered his speed, and this is going to kill him. So really, that was a stupid move, Slowpoke. Stupid! There it goes. Slash gets level 9. I can see Slash becoming MVP on this team. His only problem really is grass. Four times weak to grass moves with his rock and water typing. Oval stone. Don't even know what that does. Is that one that evolves something? Certain species of Pokemon evolve its shape like an egg. Well, if anyone knows what that makes evolve, let me know, because I haven't got a clue. And I'm, I'm sure there's encounters in here. Like, I feel like right now I should be running into, like, usually in the game, Bellsprout, but... No? Maybe I'm just completely making that shit up. We'll try again on the next floor, and if not, that's uh, that's end game. Sage Joe, and we have a love this, love this, love this water type, right? Absorb the absolute living daylights out of this kid. You know, to say six levels higher, that really doesn't, really not that effective. Oh, we got them. Oh, it's got liquid ooze. No way. Scorupi. Uh, I don't really know what you are. Oh, yeah, you're that little. I think it's a bug type. Little lobster free. No, um, I'm trying to get scorpion. That's what I'm trying to say. Yeah. Lowest defense. Obviously got some sort of plan of action here. Uh, I'm just gonna keep going for tackles. Oh, it's got bite. Oh, that's pretty. That's pretty beasty. Nice one. Good experience there as well. Come on, Hannah, learn something. Learn a move. Ah. Uh, Chimicho. I'm gonna switch out to slash again. Chamcho. Chilling. Uh, and we'll just scratch this dude, I think. Yeah, one more of them. And he is down. 
Rap's such a nothing move in these gens. It's such a good move in Gen 1, like, it's literally overpowered, and in these gens, it's such a nothing move. Excuse me! There goes Chimicho. And there goes Sejijo. Chimicho, Sejijo. I will lie. Let's just quickly head up here and see if now we start running into Pokemon. Because, I don't know, I just feel like there's encounters up here, but maybe I guess I'm wrong. Lagging Tail. Let's take a look at what that does. Oh. Items to be held by Pokemon. Tremendously heavy and makes the holder move slower than usual. I'm guessing that's for Onyx then. Well, I seem to not be able to get an encounter down here, so... I guess... Well, let's pick up this item. Elixir, that's good for later. And we will battle these guys on the next episode. Wait, there's an the encounter! I was literally going to stand still there. That was my last stop. It's a Pidgey. That's fine because it's a flyer. So when I get fly, I will have something to take me around places. So I have. I, this is not a problem. The problem is what's not going to kill it, and I think absorb might be the one. Well, it definitely didn't kill it. Scratch also shouldn't. Okay, but it does. Fair enough. Never mind. There's a real life Pidgey outside my window. I'm trying to get in. Come in if you want, lad. Here. There you go. Come in. Not interested. Thank you very much for watching this episode. Episode one-ish is what I'm going to call it. Of the Pokemon Hot Gold. Randomised. Nuzlocke, if you enjoy anything that you see on my channel, please like and subscribe. I really appreciate it. Follow me on Twitter at S-T-D-E-N-I-A-L Gaming uh, for more updates on other things. Some of the uh, art I'm making and stuff like that's on there. And uh, yeah, thank you very much and I'll see you all next time. Peace.